it might surprise you that Australia per capita sends more textile waste to landfill than almost every other country in the world. We're talking close to 1 million tonnes per annum of textile waste goes to landfill. We've been working on our waste streams and working out ways we can do a lot better with them and send less to landfill. But I'm really excited today to talk about our textile initiatives and a recent partnership we've forged as a foundation partner with Blocktex. After a long conversation with Graham Ross and our clear view that we should actually do something to, to deal with the textile waste issue rather than just talk about it. And so we decided to build a business that actually uh, reprocesses textiles at volume, at scale, here in Australia. And here we are standing in our, Australia's first textile resource recovery plant that will scale at 4,000 tonnes a year with our first reactor and then we'll scale to 10,000 tonnes from there. Essentially, uh, we have invented and commercialised a, a, a process which we use a combination of chemicals, water, uh, pressure, heat, to literally unlock the cotton from the polyester. And then when we've unlocked them, they separate into two work streams. So the polyester is washed, all the cellulose is washed off it, and then it is uh, dried and then re-extruded and reformed into a polyester pellet. The cellulose goes another way and that gets uh, decanted or filtered, and then that, in essence, centrifuged or spun into a thick clay. And that's what we sell on into the hydro malting industry. In our industry, we actually use garments between 30 and 150 times. So we do recycle to a certain extent, but at a point of time, they're no longer fit for purpose and the quality needs to be upgraded and the old needs to, to find a new home. So we're really, really excited that we've been able to find a home for that product. And, uh, and I think also important for our customers and, and the wider community to understand that we can start to do something about textile waste.